Hey YouTube, welcome back to a brand new Animal Crossing New Horizons video. Now this item here is beyond awesome. It holds a secret that's long forgotten and sadly is now only known as this. Today marks the start of a very special and unique event on the New Horizons Island Nook Friday or Sail Day as it's known as in previous versions of Animal Crossing. So today I thought it'd be fun to do a documentary style video and take a more in-depth look at Sail Day, how it all started and how the event plays out for us today. Now if you've already stopped by Nook's Cranny you may have spotted these sale signs in the window. This shows the Nook Friday event is underway and you guess it, it's an activity inspired by the real world Black Friday deals that have probably been taken over your inboxes all week. Immediately after Turkey Day Nook's Cranny holds a sale on every item in the store offering 30% off the normal price saving you 300 bells for every 1,000 bells you spend. Now I will get back to this shortly but first you may be surprised to know Nook Friday used to be called Sail Day and debuted in the original Animal Crossing game. Except here it was a New Year's celebration and Nook sold these mysterious items. By the time Animal Crossing was released outside of Japan the event got moved to November to be much more in line with Black Friday celebrations in the West but instead of sales on Sail Day Tom Nook offered these. Grab bag. A grab bag is probably the coolest item in the entire series and unfortunately has been completely forgotten about. Now grab bags, like those traditionally sold in Japan during the original New Year celebrations, contain three unique items comprising of either furniture, clothing, wallpaper, carpet or a pinwheel. The cost of the grab bag is always equal to the year, so this year each bag costs 2,022 bells. Pretty neat. Like in real life the idea is the value of the items is much higher than the price of the bag giving consumers a pretty decent discount. Now the sale day event in the original Animal Crossing titles was a pretty big deal compared to the modern version. That's because Crazy Red is also guaranteed to visit which is always nice and Tour Timer stops by to reward the player with a limited time market model item. Having extra characters visiting and a shop full of fun grab bags makes for a pretty special day. Except that's all it was. a single day. Fast forward to New Horizons and Sail Day has finally returned rebranded as Nook Friday but a lot has changed. Unlike the one day event it used to be, it now runs up to a week depending on the year. Nook Friday always takes place on the 4th Friday of November which is the day after Turkey Day. This year it starts on November 25th and runs through to November 30th, giving us almost a week of sales to look forward to and plenty of time to stock up on customization kits and new tools if you're anything like me and too lazy to craft them. And a fun fact, the Turkey Day DIY packs that appear in the cabinet at Nooks after Turkey Day can never be purchased at full price because they're only ever available during the sale day event. Pretty cool huh? Anyway, Nook Friday returned in the 2.0 update this time last year so it's only the second time the activity has occurred in New Horizons. Unfortunately, the grab bags from the original Nook Friday never returned. Or did they? Interestingly, the grab bags have some regional differences depending on how you play the original Animal Crossing. This is the grab bag sprite in the N64 and GameCube versions of Animal Crossing in Japan and this is the sprite in the IQ version in China. You'll notice that the Chinese grab bag design is very similar to the lucky red envelope that can be used to wrap bells for gifts during the Lunar New Year in New Horizons. So although the grab bags themselves never returned and the mechanics seemingly forgotten about, the concept is hinted at honouring the original New Year's version of the grab bag, which is awesome. Anyway, Nook Friday or Sail Day has only ever featured in the original Animal Crossing and now New Horizons. So even though these awesome items never return for this event, at least we can enjoy a week of discounts at Nook's. What do you think about Nook Friday? Are you hoping to find a specific item? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Thank you of course to the patrons and channel members for supporting this content and if you'd like to learn about some of the changes and updates coming to New Horizons in December, be sure to check out this next video.